we're gonna kick this one off talking about the weather and if you're in Mombasa you know what I'm talking about it's gone all whack as in this is not the Mombasa we're used to it has changed everything people are wearing sweaters people are wearing jackets for me this weather has really messed up my morning Like Sam Smith said, I know I'm not the only one, there were a bunch of us who were doing the same damn thing. This weather has messed up others more than most. Um, my, biggest my biggest trouble is getting home in the evening, the traffic is just crazy, but some people, I gotta say, have bigger problems. Anyway, so today we're going to talk about the most popular IMing program that we have right now. And everybody's on it. That's the first question people are asking. Whenever you meet anyone right now, that's the first thing you ask them. Are you on WhatsApp? Are you on this? Because, let's admit, WhatsApp is kind of addictive. And it is amazing. Some of us have been on WhatsApp since, since its heyday. As in, we've been there for so long that we got lifetime membership. I'm not kidding. Let's first of all agree that WhatsApp is an amazing application. Let's let's just get it out there because it's done so much for us. We've gotten to see a lot of things because she sent them to you. Let's talk about the evolution of WhatsApp. WhatsApp started off really simple. It's just, it's just uh, IMing. You could communicate, send messages, send pictures, send videos. It was amazing. Only hiccup was its last seen status. As in, basically, someone could tell the last time you were online and. For most people, that was kind of a bummer, because you have a lot of shit to hide. A lot. So guys at WhatsApp woke up one morning and decided that, you know what? These people don't want to be talked around like they are. So, they decided that you can hide your last scene. The only catch is, if you hide your last scene, you can't see anybody's last scene. Personally, my last scene is on. I never really had a problem with that. Now we're good. Now we're not going to have a problem. So we went on really nice, we went on okay and stuff and blah 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 and then Zuckerberg, I don't know, I can't remember when this happened, I think it was after Zuckerberg got the application, he just decided that he's gonna mess it up for everybody. I mean everybody. We all know what I'm talking about, uh, this blue tick nonsense. So those of you who don't understand, one grey tick means your message has been sent. Two grey ticks means your message has been delivered and once those two ticks turn blue, it means your message has been read. Now, this is where the problem lies. I want to be able to ignore people in peace. But now, with what these guys have done, as soon as I read your message, you know. And if I don't reply, you know that I read your message and I decided it was not worth my time to reply you at that moment. And whereas I may have just been busy, I may have been doing something else, or I may just be ignoring your ass, that is my decision to make, not yours. You're not supposed to understand that shit, but now I can hide it from you. If you're with me, join the movement, hashtag blue must go. All my social media tags and the usernames are in the description below. Follow me on Facebook, Twitter, uh, I think that's where I am only, I'm on Google+. Plus. I've been told I had an Instagram account, I'm going to work on that, but I'm not really for it. But I might just have to do it because of what, I, what I'm doing. And I will let you know when I get an Instagram account. But for now, Facebook, Twitter, Google+, Plus. that's where you can find me. And on YouTube as well, I like you can see. So like my video, give it a thumbs up right in the corner over there. Subscribe to the channel so that you can get a notification whenever something goes down on this channel. It's been Real Niggas. Peace.